Uh, I'm a producer and uh, we've been using Biosol here uh, this year on most of our land. Uh, Biosol is uh, it's made up of 30% compost and 70% elemental sulfur. There's been lots of uh, research with Biosol in the past and it's been proven to be a pretty effective product. And we're spreading it with the Omni Autonomous Unit. Uh, I'm a contractor working uh, with the Olds College uh, and with the pro uh, project uh, of uh, the DOT slash Omnipower. So this fall we have a challenge, uh, 8,000 acres, done, <laughs> with Biosol. I really like this product. The Biosol product is really just coming into its own now. So we're past, I guess, the uh, trying to prove the product now to the point where we can really scale it up. This is our third year of working with Omni. We've tried the different uh, implements and it's, it's getting better and better and running smoother and smoother all the time. A fall like this where it's wide open and the fields are uh, prepared well, it uh, just works great. Personally me, uh, I'm confident about uh, the OmniPower platform. We're collecting the different bunch of data. We uh, testing different uh, types of implements uh, such as uh, coulter, seeder, uh, sprayer, and now currently a uh, spreader. So we testing on the different fields, different regions uh, within the Alberta and different crops. We've been working uh, with Olds College on their smart farm for I think three, three years now. And uh, the purpose of our farm being involved is really to put uh, the Omni to scale. Having this uh, autonomous farming on your farm, it doesn't mean that you can just click on the bottom and take some coffee, no. Uh, you still have to be involved in the process. It's kind of a helper that uh, helps you to, to minimize uh, your expenses and also to, again, to speed up the uh, finalizing your seeding uh, campaign on your farm.